Good morning. It's still morning, thank goodness. This is Lisa from Mama Lisa's Bakery. It's a nice, cool day out today. I finally got to open up my kitchen. It was so dark in here, but I had to keep the heat out. Um, it was so hot cooking in here. But I had a great weekend um, at the baby shower for my son and his wife. Ashley, and it was a beautiful time. Took Teddy with me in the stroller. Everybody was like loving that. And, uh, very, very nice time. I got to get a Gill's pizza. So that, that's like the best pizza in Baltimore. G-I-L-S, Gill's pizza. And, uh, had a nice time visiting with my sons. And, uh, so today, I'm working on some yeast rolls. Pat, if you're watching, um, the dough's rising now. Then I had to roll them out, let them rise again. And some cinnamon rolls. And I'm going to make another batch of um, bread and butter pickles. They're really good. And let's see. I bought some corn up in Maryland. I had to buy some, even though my, my son's a corn farmer. Um, he didn't have any ready. And I picked up some things. Um, my son moved my whole apartment for me, I guess it was three years ago. And I still have a lot of stuff there. So I got to pick up some things and had a lot of cooking things. I had that little thing hanging on the wall. I put some like antique things in there. I just rearranged a little bit. I put... Um, this little shelf here, I put my basket there, and this is a cute little cat. So, and this was, um, my little grandson Henry's little, um, place that I got him to teach him to cook. <laughs> but that's another whole story. So, uh, went to the grocery store today, and a lady stopped me. She goes, oh, I want to see your puppy, older lady. She said, my friend was here. I, I came here to see if my friend was working. She said, I don't get paid until the third. I'm on disability. And her, her, uh, husband or boyfriend died a little bit ago. So I was talking to her for a little bit. So, uh, I went in and, um, bought her a pack of cigarettes and, uh, but you know, do your good deed for the day. And then, so I went back in to get her cigarettes. And I forgot to bring my my wallet in the store, so I had to go back and pay anyway. So there was a gentleman there. He was packing up, older gentleman, I guess my age. He was packing up um, a book bag, and a lady said, That's the cashier, so I'd tell him, where's your, um, what are you doing? Where's your car? He said, well, my engine blew up. And he had like, probably like 50 pounds worth of things to carry. I'm like, do you need a ride? Where are you going? He goes, well, I'm going to Ida. And it's like, it's only a few miles. So I said, I'll take you. So I gave him my card and told him if he needed a ride um, to um, give me a call because that's what we're here for. Believe me, there was times I didn't have a car and that's when my two little boys were little and I was pregnant and working. And I, luckily, I, the God, God always works out for us. Luckily, I was, uh, found a babysitter like right at the end of my street. And I would walk the kids to the babysitter and then I'd have to take a bus downtown. <laughs> but you, you always make it. So I didn't have a car for like three months and with kids and that was pretty hard. But God doesn't give us any more than we can handle. So, um, he said he was um, originally, I think, from Wisconsin. And he said he ended up in this area um, after he, um, he had a pen pal and he ended up here. And I thought that was cute. And he's, and then he, he lived on, he lives on Love Lane. Isn't that neat? So that was, it's like, um, just like reach out and be neighborly. And, um, that's what God wants us to do. 
So, Teddy's happy he got to play with his little friend Taz, my son's dog Taz. And he's tired out, he's sleeping now. And, um, so, it was all in all a great time. Um, let's see, what am I going to work on this week? I'm going to make some cookies. I'm going to make some oatmeal raisin cookies. I'm going to make some pumpkin cheesecake. I'm going to make some pumpkin cheesecake, um, muffins with my own, own special topping and um, bread and butter pickles and I believe I'm going to make another batch of um, black bean and corn sauce. Everybody to, around here is like, oh, I ate the, half the jar in one sitting. So it's pretty addicting. So I'm working on my sign. I got to show you this sign. It's crazy. Oh, I did pick up a lot of my craft items at the store. I'm at the store at my son's house. I still got like five, six trips to go. This is like really, really horrible looking. So what I'm going to do, I got some um, white poster board. I'm going to cut the letters out in white and put them on there. I really want to get some of this fabric like this that has the, uh, you can see them. Let's see. That has the chili peppers and stuff, but this fabric's you know, pretty expensive. So I got my little set up here. I made uh, three more quarts of tomatoes um, Friday. I think it was Friday. But um, if you get a chance, stop in to say hi. Um, and uh, do, do, do a good deed today and every day. Um, it always gets returned, believe me. So... Um, I hope you all have a great day. God loves you, each and every one of you, and be the reason somebody smiles today.